Good morning, everyone, and happy Friday. <laughs> uh, you're catching me without any makeup on, uh, which is fine, but um, I wanted to demonstrate for you um, one of our products that I absolutely love, and that is um, the Clear Proof Acne System, the uh, Charcoal Mask. Uh, this product is um, perfect for those who may have oily skin or have quite a few blemishes, but it also works for, for just about anybody a couple times a week. So you should mask about two to three times a week. Um, I typically do that on Wednesdays and Sundays. However, um, I uh, am coming to you on Friday because I've already masked a couple times because I've had a few facials, but I wanted to spotlight th this for for you. So, um, so these are a couple things that you would need for that. So you would just need the deep cleaning charcoal mask. Okay, um, you can apply it um, on your face after you've done your uh, cleanser. So ha make sure your face is totally clean. Um, and then um, once you've masked, then you can get ready for bed. Or once you've masked, you can get ready for your day. And then um, we'll talk about that at the end on what you're doing. So um, I also have a masking brush. It's a uh, silicone, so it, it just um, helps with application. Otherwise, you can use your fingers either way. So um, we're going to start with um, applying a little bit of the charcoal to the applicator. You probably only need about, mm, I would say, about a, a nickel size. That's about all you need. Um, I'll turn this around because I'm right-handed. Uh, you need just kind of a thin amount all over your face. And I usually start with my nose because it's not obviously a flat surface, so it, it does take a little bit of time depending on how much you put on there. A small amount does go a long way, and you want to try to avoid the eye area. So um, when I apply, I'm just going to apply like a little dab here and a little dab here, like almost like a football player. And then I'm going to start to apply up my nose and down uh, for the simple fact that um, I take a, a little larger chunks off of the, of the applicator. So, and then I just start to move it around my face. Um, I know my problem areas really are on my nose and on my chin. Uh, that's where I tend to be a little more um, oily and also across my forehead. That's like your T-zone. So once I kind of get the mask <clears throat> on, uh, I just spread it around. That works out perfectly then. Um, and then I like to get it as thinned out as possible for the simple fact that then I know that it'll dry quicker. Um, it doesn't take very long to dry, I know that. So it's kind of a, um, a very, um, it smells like minty. It has a minty smell to it. Spread that out a little bit more, avoiding my, my eyes. And I'll tell you more about it as it's drying. Um. Keep spreading it out so that it dries. I do like to get in my eyebrows, around my eyes here at the top, because it, it tends. It seems like that's where a lot of the grease will get trapped or whatever. So I just spread that out. So masking's not too difficult of a of a task. Um, so I I do have my notes in front of me, so I didn't skip anything because uh, as I had mentioned before so now I'm gonna let that dry it feels it feels really good actually um, so when you apply the charcoal onto the applicator okay um, it is automatically starts to activate with the air and um, it gets rid of any dirt oil and impurities that are on your face that gets caught in your pores and a little bit of science that I learned as I'm going through and learning about the application process of 
some of these products is that when your skin is nice and tight and your skin is smooth you appear younger okay so as um, you get dirt and impurities and oils trapped in your pores then your skin starts to separate some and then that's where like gaps begin and then that is where you're going to see wrinkles so when you mask um, it helps take out some of those um, impurities and dirt and oil and whatever substance is caught in your skin it's kind of like a bunch of potholes on the outside of your skin and it gets caught in there and so the more we apply makeup and cover up and things of that nature then it just seems to compile all of that garbage with inside of that now I know when you drive on the roads it's bumpy and it's not smooth so it's almost like a mask for your skin is like a resurfacing so it kind of takes those things away those gaps then close and then your face will appear to be a lot more smooth which is great um, as to unclog some of those pores then your face obviously is going to be cleaner and it's going to be a more healthy and then your pores are going to be minimized so that's ultimately what um, my notes are telling me as it reminds me I don't want to skip anything um, and I can tell it's starting to dry a little bit too because it's starting to tighten up which is good because that means it's taking that junk out and then my skin is starting to tighten together which is exactly what you want um, sometimes we tend to be a little more oily uh, as seasons change so um, as we're coming out of winter and, and now in the springtime um, sometimes that happens because our skin is more dry in the winter time and then it starts to become a little more oily as it changes into the into the spring and so um, it's a good time to think about masking for sure um, and then also depending on um, maybe some chemical changes in your body depending on the time of month it is sometimes that happens um, a mask is very absorbent absorbent my, my face is starting to tighten up uh, it actually can hold uh, a lot of the impurities that um, it takes out double its weight so that's kind of interesting um, see some of my other notes that I wanted to make sure I shared with you oh and I was telling you about how it smells it smells great um, I learned that it has honeysuckle and navy bean extracts in that, which I think is kind of interesting. Um, and it, it targets the appearance of your skin and its discoloration. And then it helps smooth the skin, which I've already mentioned. Um, this is also the kind of mask that you would wipe away with uh, a little bit of soap and water. Or just water in general, you know, like a soapy... Um, cloth but you can just wipe it right off if you want with water and a, and a, and a washcloth um, it's not the one that pulls off the ones that pull off are actually not very good for your skin because it could take off the top layer um, I know I've seen commercials on those and they, they don't advise that because they don't want to take off any any of your skin cells not the dirt dirt they can take off but not the skin itself um, so like I had mentioned earlier I mask twice a week, usually on Wednesdays, and Sundays are my two masking days. Um, this particular type of mask is suitable for all types of skin care uh, customers, skin types, tones, whether it be normal to dry or combination oily. It's tested for all kinds of skin irritabilities and allergies. Um, it's dermatologist tested, and it's suitable for people who are more uh, prone to blemishes or have sensitive skin. And um, I'm trying to think if if you, I don't know if you can tell, but in the video, I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's starting to dry. And you can see where some parts are drier than others, and some parts are a little more wet. But um, if you were to get a sample, if you wanted to try it uh, before you make any purchases, um, you're going to notice there's little, like, blackheads. They look like blackheads, anyways. That is the mask going into the pores and then pulling out the impurities. Um, I know when I do it that's that's what I see and I'm, I'm always a little bit embarrassed about that um, but if it takes out the dirt and the oil and the dry skin that's stuck in my pores it's gonna make my skin look much uh, younger and healthier then I'm willing to embarrass myself on a video. <laughs>
So hopefully that's kind of how you feel too. So um, anyone that uh, purchases from Kelly's Party, um, the clear, clear proof mask um, will also be getting for free uh, from her party um, the applicator. It is, it's nice to have, be able to put it on and just rinse it off instead of getting it all over your hands. It's not a big deal, but um, I am running that special right now. So that way um, you have something to use for that. So it's pretty dry. Um, so I have a little towel out here. So I'm going to go ahead and rinse my face off. I have some warm water. Kept the amount of water down, seeing how I am in my office. Um, I don't have a upstanding... Um, camera holder so for the bathroom so it's a little bit more difficult and then because we definitely don't want to help mother nature out we're just going to do up and out for the wiping off of the mask so that we can get all that off yeah so a little embarrassing to have me have no makeup on but you know we're all women and that's what we do we have to take care of our skin you know, and I don't, I definitely don't want to look older than I am. I want to look as young as possible for as long as possible. You know? And I assume that most of you feel the same way. And even though we're in the quarantine, um, I still take a shower every day, I do my hair every day, I do my makeup every day because I want to have a sense of normalcy so I don't get the uh, daily blues I don't um, I don't have um, any psychological uh, downfalls to uh, to the quarantine so um, having my Mary Kay products to demonstrate or to help other women um, with facials actually has been very motivating for me daily so I really appreciate you um, taking the time to sit with me okay so now that I have cleaned my face off um, it feels it feels really smooth it's a little damp still but um, it feels really smooth uh, once you are done masking whether you're getting ready for your day or whether you're getting ready for bed you should always put on a moisturizer so for me today, um, I'm going to put on, um, I cleaned my face with the TimeWise uh, set. So I cleaned my face already before the mask with the TimeWise 3, uh, 3D. This is the 4-in-1 cleanser. This is what cleans my face. Then I masked. Now today I'm ready for my uh, moisturizer. So I have the 3D um, day cream. So I will just put a little bit of my moisturizer on and I only need about a dime size of that. Put that together and I'll rub that in. This smells so fresh. It smells like almost like a cucumbery kind of smell. And I just wipe that in. Kind of up and out, up and out, up and out, up and out, up and out. And then as I um, do that also, I do my, my neck and my chin because um, don't definitely do not want any crazy business there. As far as like chicken neck or whatever. My, my grandma used to call it a chicken neck. You don't want a chicken neck. And then um, as I start my day or at nighttime, either one, we have, I just look a little shiny there. Um, the time wise, this is called the age minimizing eye, eye cream. And this helps get rid of wrinkles around your eyes. Now this, it's a little bottle because you don't need a lot. Um, and so when normally we put it on our index finger, but for the age-defying um, eye cream, we're going to put it on our ring finger. And the reason we do that is because your ring finger is your weakest finger on, on both of your hands. And around your eyes, your skin is the most um, uh, pliable and it's the weakest. So it has a, a really good chance of stretching out. Um, with any amount of tugging and pulling. So that's the first place you're going to get wrinkles. So you want to use the weakest fingers to use on the weakest part of your face as far as skin wise. So I'm going to stipple that on a little bit and I go all the way around the outside edge. Okay. And I also rub a little bit on my, the, 
the rim of my nose up to my eyebrows because if you ever notice when someone squints together this is where you're gonna see a lot of wrinkles so I don't know I, I, don't, I can't stop squinting but I can maybe stop the wrinkles from showing up so I do apply that and I spread that out and then I'll just go back over and just rub that in very very gently because I don't want all that elasticity in my eye skin to uh, to pull away and so that's pretty much my my facial so just to kind of recap um, we have the clear proof the deep cleansing charcoal mask it's always a mouthful and then with the special for Kelly's party we have the applicator and then I just briefly kind of went over the um, time-wise um, skincare products very quickly um, I did a, a demonstration video a couple days ago on how that looks when you go to apply your makeup so I'm ready for makeup right now so I talked about the cleanser and then I also just kind of briefly went over the day cream to moisturize from my day and moisturize my eyes. At nighttime, there is a nighttime moisturizer. So you would use the TimeWise cleanser, clean your face, and then you'd moisturize throughout the night. It's the little gray bottle, so you can tell pink is for day, gray is for night. And then you have your eye cream. Now my special with any of my skincare sets is you will get a Mary Kay headband to help keep that out of your keep your hair out of your face. My hair is getting longer because of the quarantine and I know some of you have ponytails and that so you can kind of keep it up but I don't like to get all this product in the little tendrils of my hair so I like to keep it back. So if you order a skincare set you'll get the Mary Kay um, headband also just to use that to keep your hair back. Okay, um, if you have any questions or if you want to see something demonstrated or anything in particular, please let me know in the comments. All right, you guys have a great rest of your Friday. Take care now.